Um, of course, we're going to have to talk about Anderson Silva. He was released by the UFC. There's always talks about him coming back. MMA, boxing, bare knuckle. You know, they've thrown his name all over the place because everybody <laughs> loves Anderson. You know, they they of don't course. really want to see him retire. Can you give us any updates on the legend? You know, right now, you know, obviously that's not how one wants to finish their UFC career, right? Um, but I think one of the big things for Anderson's I mean, he transcended the sport for us, and he was already a veteran by that time. I think people forget that by the time he came to UFC and won his belt, he's already in his early 30s. You know, he already had a career before that in Pride, um, over there in England. You know, he he's had a long career. So this is a moment that I think you mentioned, like, you know, stay in shape, but enjoy this. Enjoy this time. When was the last time you got to have a break from thinking about fighting, thinking about the next fight? He's been doing this for a very long time. So, you know, all those things I think he's definitely considering. And it's just a matter of time to see what his decision will be. I'm I'm still holding on to the to the matchup of him facing uh, Roy Jones Jr. I, yeah. I, I want to see it. I, I think yeah. it's a selfish thing for me to say, but two legends, you know, and they've, yes. they've wanted to face each other in the past. It just like kind of makes sense a little. I don't know. Yeah, I don't think uh, people who aren't fans know that those two were uh, pegged to fight before mm -hmm. Connor and, and Mayweather yeah. was even even a thought. Mm -hmm. You know, this is like probably when Connor was just entering into the UFC mm -hmm. that uh, both of those two legends, Anderson and Roy, were starting to talk about fighting each other, right? And it's a shame that it never happened back then. Um, yeah, so. I'm with you. Like selfishly, I would love to see that. Not even as a coach, as a fan, I would just love to see it because, you know, when was the last time anyone has seen Anderson in a boxing, boxing ring? Yeah. But I can tell you that his boxing skills are amazing. Yeah, and and a lot of what Roy Jones did, he did in the octagon. I don't think people yeah. realize that. Yeah, yeah. So, yeah. so I think. Uh, you know, just seeing the old footage of him sparring, boxing, you know, doing it with great athletes, you know, it's, it's exciting to think of that as a possibility again.